Hey everyone! So today we're going to check what message Spirit has for you. Um, let's just let um, Spirit come through. Kung ano man yung message for whatever it is that you are experiencing today. <coughs> so let's see. Um, Spirit message or advice for my friends today. Different situation. Whatever. So you have your strength. Okay. Funny kasi we are. Just finished the new season. And then you have three of cups. Nine of swords. Okay. So for a majority of you, you could be experiencing some issues with people or siguro parang some form of miscommunication with three of cups here in reverse and the nine of swords. It could be na you're feeling that you don't belong. <laughs> Kung nasan man kayo ngayon, it could be na parang um, you feel na people are judging you. That's a thing that I'm getting. Which, to be fair, nagkakaroon ka tuloy ng stress about it and self-doubt. Um, for most of you, I think that this would have something to do with workplace. Siguro parang hindi kayo nagkakaintindihan ng mga katrabaho ninyo. Um, you could be in a managerial position or at least trying to be, um, to fill in that role. So let's get some more cards for clarity. So you have here the Two of Wands. You have the Knight of Cups. Knight of Wands. Okay, so swords. Ang dami ninyong nire-require na action dito. Judgment. And the king of swords. Underneath the deck, you have the four of cups. Okay. So, first and foremost, itong na-experience ninyong ngayon, which is leading you to have some confusion about yourself sa capabilities ninyo. This is actually a blessing in disguise which will give you the chance to get to get or be given more opportunities in the workplace. Be it in business, the workplace, or siguro sa mga personal relationships ninyo. This is, ito yung tipong sitwasyon na parang you're having hardship right now kasi mas magiging, kumbaga, you're being prepared for something. Think of it that way. With the Two of Wands being here, and the Knight of Cups, and the Knight of Wands, the Knights being both in reverse, this will actually require movement from you. You will be moving through this incident. Whether you're being pushed to move or get out of the situation that you are in, or to come out of this situation better. For most of you, there could be some travel involved. And think of it na parang, siguro itong nangyayari sa inyo, about these difficulty with people, the sleepless nights that you've been getting, probably stressed kayo, pagod kayo sa current situation ninyo. Just endure, and wag, kayong, wag niyong hayaan na mawala yung kumpiyansa niyo sa sarili just because other people think um, or just because just because people think otherwise. I remember I was speaking with a friend earlier, and then saying, and then she said that um, the lion does not lose sleep over the opinion of sheep. And the nine of swords does talk about sleep, does talk about you know nightmares, does talk about the things that haunt you in your dreams. And the fact that these are both here. Wag ninyong ilimit yung potential ninyo on being able to do great things just because may mga tao who are judging you, who are saying otherwise, who are probably spreading lies. Wag ninyo silang intindihin. The Knight of Cups and the Knight of Wands here just strongly suggest na whatever it is that you feel so passionate about, whatever it is that you love, and probably that's the reason why you're doing all of these things, why you're so great at what you're doing, kasi you love it, you're passionate about it, gusto mo yung ginagawa mo. So, so i-continue mo lang um, i-continue mo lang yung reaching out. Being the bigger person. As much as I hate to say that, you have to try and continue to be the bigger person. Why? Kasi eventually, kung ano man yung mga sinabi nila, lalabas at lalabas naman yung totoo. And this will turn around in such a way na mabibigla ka na na parang, oh, oh my God, okay. Karma's a bitch. They got what they deserve. And with Judgment Card being here and the King of Swords, you'll notice na parang yung third line mo is about, is about, um, is about being saved. It's about being, kumbaga parang, 
yung tipong naabsuelto ka sa kung ano man yung mga sinabi nila without you even doing anything. You will rise from this situation as someone better and someone who has been given more opportunities than what you can imagine. For most of you, I think, like I said earlier, na this has something to do about the workplace, this has something to do about people who are in a management position, people who are trying to kumaga, guide other people. And for some reason, etong three of cups na to, especially with those swirling signs, with this ace of swords na parang swirling din dito, I think na parang there could be an instance where you felt betrayed, where you felt na parang people you trusted did not give you justice, did not understand where you were coming from, only were quick to judge you, and that's fine. Continue to love them anyway. Pero you just have to be careful kasi at the end of the day naman, lalabas at lalabas naman kung ano yung totoo eh. Yung effort mo, yung mga ginagawa mo magaganda, people who matter will notice what you are doing. So, <clears throat> oh, lumabas pa to. Let's get some advice. I was thinking of getting some advice. So, you have here your Nine of Pentacles and the Four of Wands. These are actually two of very positive parts. The Nine of Pentacles talks about um, getting getting the best in life for your own self-fulfillment. And the Four of Wands is things just falling together. So, what are you supposed to do? Go back to your roots. <clears throat> Try to realize why you're doing this in the first place. You're being the, if you're a parent na nagiging mahigpit ka sa anak mo, why are you doing that? Because you love your children. Gusto mo silang matuto. You want them to be prepared for life. If um, if you if this talks about a partner, ayaw mo maging pabayaan yung partner mo kasi you want them to you want them to be ready for life with or without you and you want to grow with them. If this is a job, you're trying to guide your people because you've been there in that situation with that same mindset and you don't want them to make the same mistakes that you did before. So, i-continue mo lang ano yung ginagawa mo. Trust that you are doing this because you have the strength, the capability, and the understanding to realize na, eh, ganun talaga yung buhay. Hindi na lahat perfect. And watch as things <clears throat> fall into place. The fourth one is the mo one of the most positive cards in the minor arcana. And the fact that it goes hand in hand with your nine of pentacles, which talks of self-fulfillment, <clears throat> um, self-justification, just really <clears throat> getting the benefits, getting the blessings that you deserve. Besh maghanda ka na for all the blessings in your life. So you have your temperance in reverse and the devil. Okay. Back of the deck, you have the knight of pentacles. So ang ibig sabihin lang nito is you just proceed with caution. Huwag ka masyadong pabigla-bigla. You do have the tendency to be a little brash about it. Uh, medyo masyado ka nagmamadali, you let your emotions get the best of you sometimes. And it's not really totally wrong. I mean, some people are really just built that way to have a little bit more emotion, which translates to them having a lot of empathy for other people. But with temperance here in the devil card, this is just really advising you na try to look at other avenues on how you're going to resolve the situation. Kung baga, try to teach yourself to learn things as well. Kasi meron kang tendency, and this is actually, you know, some guidance for you. Meron ka kasi tendency na you stick with what you know. Eh, kasi probably for the longest time, it has worked for you that way. You could have approached multiple things in the same way that you're trying to approach this current situation that you are in into now. Pero you're being advised to proceed with caution. Try to explore other things. Try to see um, other options which you can explore para mas maging maayos dun situation mo. But at the end of the day, trust the positive energy and trust the universe will give you what you deserve. And right now naman kasi wala akong nakikitang anything negative na plinaplano ninyo. All of these confusion, all of your heart, it's actually resulted from you wanting to help other people, wanting to help your team, wanting to help your family. So, um, be guided na itong nangyayari sa'yo is just something that is meant to make you stronger and something that will give you positive fruit. So, um, that's it for your reading today. Thank you so much for staying with me and I will see you on your next video.